Hello everybody, welcome again Roscoe's Gaming back with another video for everybody to enjoy and today I have a uh, new one I haven't played in a while. This is Scenarios everyone. Now everybody knows about this pretty sure if you've been playing Warships lately but if you haven't been, Wargaming has been doing a new line of missions that are basically uh, missions you can play. Um, all different abilities, different actions, and stuff like that. Uh, today, I'm joined in with Spy and So New. Um, we're in joining cruisers, and uh, this is going to be interesting. Now, the way this mission goes, automatically, you get a, a primary task and a Attack secondary task. Attack the enemy naval base from the specified directions. Okay, so the main one is to destroy, as you can see, the ships at the base. At the end, we're supposed to retreat back. The other objectives on the secondaries start popping up automatically. The second one is to destroy all enemy forts and facilities. And also destroy five support ships within that base. Now, I go right off the bat for that fort on the one side. Now, I already told everybody I'll head north. Enemy heavily damaged. Now, if you guys are having trouble taking out these forts, use AP on the forts. You can see, I fired one volley. Here goes my next volley. And Enemy severely damaged. 88,000. Destroyed. Now bear with me guys. I'm having... It's... Try to remember. Now there's another fort over there. I can't reach it. But there's my allies are trying to fire at it. I'm gonna try but... I think that's a fool's hard chance. That fort on the other side, though, I'm gonna try to fire at it. Bring up my scout plane, and I'm gonna go fire at this thing. Now, Sonu knows that she can't do anything with those forts. To those forts, but we're gonna still get this thing. We're still gonna get this. Hell with high water. This is gonna be a tough one. Here on the map, Confirmed penetration. marking locations, marking targets, and telling everybody suppress the fort down south. We have to get that fort out. If we don't, we don't have all of them. You have to get all forts. Now the grab target onshore facilities. That's that's the thing. But the other targets you gotta do is get these forts. Now, I'm going to go out for the far range for back here. I'm thinking at the two in the north because sometimes you can miss these two. And I'm pretty quick in my Molotov. So I can just take these out in a hard base. Meanwhile, the rest of the fleet is making their way down. Alright, that volley should kill it. Here it comes. And yeah, that's, 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 that's a dead four. Now you can see there's there's the hangars and all the onshore targets. Now if you guys got onshore targets, you have trouble taking them out. Here's an AP. Well, that's why you use HE on those. The forts because you have to use APs because the armor plating of the fort itself, the concrete bunker of itself, you need an armor piercing round to penetrate within the bunker and explode within contact to destroy the installations inside. Makes sense. Last volley. Nope, nope, nope. I thought that would be the last one. It's alright. These guns reload pretty quick. Molotov is a very beautiful ship. If you guys ever get this chance to get this on premium, get your hands on it. It's a lot of fun. Russian derp guns. Really fast velocities. Uh, close custom to it would be the, the Italian cruiser that they released. I do like the Italian one just a little bit better because the armor on it is a little more devastating. However, it's still pretty good. Now we're making our way down. And our Omaha is Leroy Jenkinsing down and doesn't see those two torpedoes. And nearly gets wiped. You gotta keep changing positions. If you stay the same way, you're gonna get shrecked. Now still not in range but the Omaha did take out the first station and second station we're working on the power station still need to get that one four on the side so new and a fellow cruiser are making way around the 
island at the targets. Concentrate fire on the target. And they're asking for a little bit of help on those that destroyer, and we're making our way, but I feel the pressure. See, the thing about this is, no matter how cool you like, oh, we got this, we're killing chips, and we're killing stuff, you have to do this quick. You have to move fast. Well, then get a destroyer. No, that's, that's, then you're reducing your chance of damage. So you need to have at least one or two Fusos. If you have a carrier, that's going to help out a little bit in the later part of this game, you'll see. Um, but the tougher parts are yet to come. Omaha is nearly dead. Oh boy, I'm trying to save him. I'm trying to help out our ally here. Reloading AP. We gotta take out that fort. Come on guns, reload, reload. Shells out. Our Omaha is nearly dead. There you go. Fort is out. Now I'm going to go and tr see here. I think I'm trying it at this time. Yeah, I'm going to go after the Colberg. Assist my allies taking out a lightly armored cruiser. That's way lower tier to me. But makes sense in this game. Shells out. No short in the grouping. See, that's the other problem I have with doing these missions. It's bots, so the slow, and they're confusing to aim at compared to actual real computers. Or, like, actual people online. Because they usually go either fast, or they always do the same stupid patterns over and over again. We still haven't lost our Fuso, but, uh, our, uh, Omaha, but, uh, I fear his death very soon. Alright, now I'm letting go of that chip. I'm still firing AP, so... I switch over to Ichi. And now my goal is to assist and take out any of these targets. We have to kill the depot, which I'm firing at right now. And here comes an enemy torpedo, and here comes that. Bye bye. Usually, penetration. I just take an ounce targets as I go. Enemy severely damaged. Now you have to hit all these ground targets. The fuel storage is a, it's a side point, but I kill everything the lone humankind out there. Okay, there we go. We definitely, we technically destroyed all facilities. You don't have to go through the fuel storage, but I thought it's an added bonus. Our Omaha has officially now died. Now the carrier is going to go directly after me. However, it's kind of a bad idea because I do have defensive fire. Reconnaissance reporting. Enemy reinforcement approaching. Now we get the next mission. First and second waves are coming in to support the base, defending its allies. So now we gotta do is survive, get to our haven after taking out these tasks. Um, and take out the first and second wave and the two carriers. Easy! Oh, and don't let the allies get into the haven. However, that's going to be tough because right now we still haven't killed all the ships yet. And the haven is still not spotted because of that. I almost got this support ship. That's it. Now we gotta kill the Kaiser. Now my AP rounds aren't gonna do stuff to that ship. But you have to kill the Kaiser. You have to kill that ship. 
So we're f I'm firing HE at it because I have a very good chance of fire and my structures will pin the target. Okay, next volley. And, of course, no fires. At this time, I think at that time, I was bickering about why, why me, why am I not getting any fires, RNG, you evil fiends, and then, Main task complete. Retreat to the designated area. now you can see where the haven is, it's now located up north, so now I am retreating and turning my big, skinny, longy cruiser way back up there as quick as I can. And so far, Spy's over there too. He's he moved up pretty close. He didn't probably need to move that close up there, but we're up there. They're so new. And now I'm making that turn. I'm on it. So I'm turning. Our battleships are moving towards the right, towards the haven, which is actually not a bad move. We just gotta watch out for enemy ships coming towards us. I'm trying to move closest to Davy Jones. Um, Reconnaissance reporting. The second enemy reinforcement party is approaching. Yeah, I hate that voice as much as you do, everybody. <laughs> uh, but we, I'm gonna try to get back with our Cleveland to help support, and there is the first of the carriers and the wakataki and his uh there i don't know why they named him that but i'm waiting for copyright infringements on that name <laughs> uh but what do you know what what do they know what do they know well, i'm trying to get closer to that o show now i got some rounds on him Now, if I fire AP at it, because I think I can paint the deck, but... Well, after I fired that first volley, I went, Yeah, that ain't gonna happen, so... I fire again, and I switch right over to HE. I already had the shells reloaded, so... It was... Worthless not to waste the rounds. And now we're getting close to that destroyer, so... I'm gonna fire volleys at that. And of course, I just barely miss him, because, well, the world doesn't like me. Target penetrated. At the time, I was having a little problem with the spotter planes, too. They kind of send you high up when you're trying to hit a target. Defensive fire that goes off for me, and those planes are getting shredded like Swiss cheese. Direct front. Unfortunately, I didn't see the cross torpedo, and I did get hit. Now I do know I got to take out that destroyer, so I focus on him first. Should I went for the other target? Yeah. But it was too late. Here we got a target taken out. Now I'm in trouble. I'm on fire. I got no repair. And my rudder's out. So at this time, I was already freaking out going, we're, we're in trouble here. I'm in trouble here, mainly. And I had my... Def I had defensive fire. Um... I'm already asking allies for help here, but everybody's trying to move as quick as they can to me. I'm trying to back up as quick as I can. My rudder's back. Unfortunately, this is not looking good. I'm good like I'm going to take a torpedo here. So I'm assuming I'm going to die, so I'm firing last volleys. And there we go, I died. But however, I did like that I got a fire on that carrier, so that did help out a little bit. So now, let's go and watch Spy here. All stations, concentrate fire on the target. All stations, requesting fire on the designated target.
now we're trying to finish these last two. We have Davy Jones, and we have Spy in Izuiho, and they're focusing that carrier as quick as they can. Trying to reload their six inch guns as fast as they can and span fire that, cr that carrier. And looks like he missed again. Crimping looks pretty good. But the rounds are going just a tad short. They're hitting him in the nose. And the spy's getting a little close to comfort over there with that that Kohlberg. And there goes that carrier. Now they need to kill one more ship. And we get this. However, it's looking a little worse for wear. And Mexico is having a very hard time taking out that Kaiser. And New York is really not helping them very much. You can see he's just sitting there, barely firing his guns while the New York is Mexico's desperate trying to kill this guy. And he nearly kills him, but there we go. Now the, those teams are out. Now everybody needs to just get full retreat with half the squad in that circle. Cleveland's getting in there. It's not looking good though. And of course there's the saltiness in the match. Doesn't matter, we finished the match. And there we go guys. That's, that's, that's operations. Now, of course, I didn't do so well, but for God's sakes, I only killed a few things, but I'm hoping you guys get a, a rough idea how operations go with that mission. Um, we got one more mission to go, and then it looks like all everything's going to be updated into hard mode, possibly. I don't know everything about that. And then also, I've heard rumors of another mission stuff that's coming out in a couple weeks, possibly in July. Um celebrating the history of Dunkirk. I heard Dunkirk operations are going to be coming out very shortly, so stay tuned to that for everybody in Warship. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, take care, and I hope you all enjoy.